Fuck, I'm gonna fuck. It was raining this morning, and uh, I got out of the shower and I was like, let me post something on Twitter. See if y'all got some questions for me. Lo and behold, you did, especially Natalia. Thank you. Go follow me on Twitter. All right, here we go. Rapid fire. Uh, Natalia asks, you list physics and went to school for astrophysics? But so many areas of physics. Aside from the physics you pursued, what other physics are you most into and why? Classical, modern, general relativity, particle, geo, bio, astro, nuclear physics, thermodynamics. I don't know if that's the type of physics. Without a doubt, classical physics. Because it is absolutely outstanding and astounding how right Isaac Newton got most of physics four or 500 years ago. Classical physics, without a doubt. Okay, Natalia, boom! I know books are always in rotation. What books are in the lineup this week? Actually, backtrack. How often fast do you read a book and do you read one straight through or a chapter here and there in multiple books? Natalia, my goal is like four books a week. I set aside like an hour of reading time every single morning right when I wake up just to read. So what books are in the lineup this week? I'm glad you asked. Okay, this week in particular, the courage to be disliked. <sighs> really fascinating. But at any given point, I'm reading like, I don't know, three, four, five books. It's actually kind of funny because I read different chapters out of those books at different times, and they're all sitting in different places for the mood I'm in. So this sits next to my morning coffee. On my bedside table is a fiction book along with a book on love languages, oddly enough. Andre says, what agency do you look up to when it comes to video editing? Thanks. Keep up the good work, Andres. Thanks for keeping up on me to keep up the good work. Frankly, Andres, I don't really look up to any agency. I just watch videos on YouTube. But one that we talk about internally all the time for their culture and the way they've set up their portfolio and the amazing, amazing formal commercial work they do is Sandwich Co. Sandwich.co. What came to be of the old electric bike, Natalia says. Well, oh, shit, it's not here. I still got it, I still love it. I couldn't find a good fit to give the other one away to, and uh, yeah, some other stuff came up. Last question involving Dylan. Can we get more inline skate sessions with Dylan? Natalia, I don't know if he told you, but actually he was meant to go to that one last week and he went to go buy a helmet and couldn't find a helmet because helmets are required. Helmets are good. Oh, you mean in the videos. Yeah, if, if you mean in the videos, we, we could probably make that happen. If you mean in, in real life with you at some skating events, well, he needs to find a helmet. Okay, what do you think? Q&A? Five-ish questions? I think that was fun. Talk about physics, books, agencies. Do we make this a thing? Let me know down below. If you didn't get the memo this morning, go follow me on Twitter, Henry Belcaster. If, if, if you really want this, I suppose Ken and I can make A, this happen more regularly, and B, a fun little intro for, for Q&A sessions. If not here too, like I said, we're gonna go do this on another platform where we can uh, hang out with each other live. Okay, see you tomorrow. By the way, that, that, that sandwich part, it's not sandwich co, it, it's definitely just sandwich. I, I just realized I said that and um, it, it was kind of weird. It is still sandwich.co, so you, you should go check them out.